right to start off with you know create a new document next you want to change the background color to make it easier to see so do that just select all choose your color and click alt backspace which will color in next you want to create a new layer for your torn paper so get a white color and use the rectangle tool to draw out the back, the background of your paper and using the lasso tool you want to make a jiggly jaggedy bottom edge to your paper right, the next thing you want to do is get, select the pen tool and go along the bottom of your paper make sure it's on the line if not it just won't look right so once you've done that you're going to select your brush tool and you want to select the one that I'm showing you now then you want to get on to the brush design mode and click on shape dynamics make sure the size jitter is all the way to 100 and copy everything else that I have so once you've done that you can exit that and select the pen tool again then right click on your pen line and click stroke path ok so there is click enter and then you've got your bottom edge of torn piece of paper and just adding a few effects to make it look more paperish so blending options now to go and stick a different colour on it, so maybe a pale yellow, like an oldish paper maybe, and just stick a texture on it, and they come with a lot of textures, so it's grayscale paper, and just find the lined one, yeah there it is, so now I'll just, just change the depth and stuff of it to what you want. Mucking around here, you can do anything. So that's it, pretty much done there. You just muck around with those, see what you like. Actually, one thing I'm going to do is I'm going to stick a drop shadow on it, make it look like it's off the background. And there you have it, how to make torn paper on Photoshop.